Hey guys, welcome. So today's video is going to be a tutorial on how to do a fill, a refill, infill, however you guys want to call it. So I've had these nails on for about three weeks and as you can see, they look pretty rough. I'm missing a lot of stones and yeah, they just look rough. So I'm going to start off by removing all the bling. So I'm just using a cuticle nipper and this is like an old pair so i just use it specifically for removing the bling um you don't want to use one that you actually use to you know cut your cuticles because you'll just mess it up now i'm coming in with a medium grit carbide bit this is by dashboard beauty i don't know the exact name uh, but I'll have it linked in the description. I think they're actually sold out on these. It came in a set I did a review on it a while back on my channel So if you guys want to see that review, you guys could go check it out. But anyways, I'm using this just to remove the gel polish So when I'm doing this, I'm not trying to file down the acrylic. I'm just trying to get rid of all the gel polish Alright, so this is how my nails look like after filing off the gel polish and now I'm going to push back my cuticles. So now I'm coming in with my 180 sanding band and I'm using this at the lowest speed I can. My drill is kind of like weird and it won't let me set it like lower than a 3. If you guys have the McCart drill, you guys know what I'm talking about. Or maybe it's just mine. I don't know. Um, so yeah, I'm just removing the shine from my natural nail. And then I'm also removing any lifted areas. As you guys can see here, when I remove the lifted areas, I'm not filing my actual nail. I'm just filing on top of the lifted acrylic. I did have quite a bit of lifting on this set. I don't know why. I think it might have been because of the primer that I use. I normally use the Young Nails Protein Bond, but for this set, I actually ended up using the Nail Supply Glamour uh, primer. So I think that might have been it. I don't know. <laughs> As you guys can see here, I had a lot of lifting on my thumb, so I ended up taking the same cuticle nippers that 
I used in the beginning to remove my bling. So I used that to clip off the lifted areas. So then I went back in with my sanding band and then I filed that lifted area again to flatten it out a bit more because if not, it would have just been kind of bulky, you know? Um, and then I'm taking this diamond bit and it's just uh, for the cuticle area and I'm just using it to you know clean up my cuticles um, and also I kind of go over the lifted areas with that to smooth it out a little bit more So now I'm taking my 100, 180 grit file and I'm just redefining the shape a little bit. After wearing your nails for a while, they do tend to lose their shape. I've seen some girls though on Instagram, their nails still look bomb after like a month. And I'm like, how do you keep that shape like that? Because mine go around after like a week. Um, anyways, maybe because I use my nails too much, I don't know. Young Nail Swipe and a manicure brush, I think that's what they're called. And I'm just cleaning off my nail. And this also dehydrates the nail, so you don't have to put a nail prep, but I do. So I use the Nail Supply Glamour Nail Prep, and I'm only applying that onto my natural nail. And this is just going to dehydrate the nail, so it's going to get rid of any oils that may be on your nails. And then I'm going to be using the Young Nails Protein Bond, and I'm applying that, again, only to my natural nail. And I'm going to be applying two coats of this. So I'm going to be using the clear acrylic by Mia Secret, and the Nail Supply Glamour Monomer, and the Alpha Oval Brush in a number 9. Alright, so here I'm going to show you how I pick up my beads. So what I do is I dip the tip of my brush into the monomer and I wipe off some monomer on the side of my dappin dish. And then I dip the tip of my brush into the powder. And then I kind of like bounce my brush into the powder like twice. Um, and then I pat the back side of my brush onto the paper towel to remove more liquid. And the reason I do that is because I like to use drier beads around the cuticle area. So I apply the bead of acrylic where the growth is at, so basically right underneath the cuticle area. Then I pat the acrylic towards the cuticle area, but making sure that I don't touch the cuticle. Um, and then I gently swipe the acrylic towards the tip. So I'm going to repeat this onto all of my nails and on some of the nails I do apply an extra bead if I feel like I need it. 
But um, yeah, it's basically the exact same thing. This is how my nails look like after application and now I'm going to be filing so I'm using this round top ceramic bit and it's a medium grit and I'm going to use this to file around the cuticle area and the entire nail to smooth it out. drill bit I used in the beginning of the video to remove the gel polish but yeah I'm just gonna use this bit to seal in the cuticle area and then I'm using my sandy band again to smooth out the nail even more I don't usually do this step but since I'm gonna be using gel polish I just want to make sure that my nails are super smooth and that I don't have like any bumps or anything like that. So now I'm just taking my 180 grit nail file to redefine the shape. So I'm just filing the sidewalls and the tip. taking my nail buffer and just buffing out my nose and what this is gonna do is just get rid of any scratches that may be on my nails
All right, so Madam Glam sent me some more polishes to try out for you guys. So these polishes are a part of the new collection that they just released called Say Yes to the Nude. So I picked out five colors and they sent them to me. So the colors I picked were Dove, Soft Pink, I Do, Elegance, and Lotus. So these are the swatches. I did three coats for these swatches. Um, because I just wanted to see how they would look like with three coats. But they're really pretty with just two coats. But anyways, I'm going to be using I Do for this set. These colors are super sheer, but they're super pretty. I've been loving sheer colors, like sheer nudes. So I really love these polishes. Um, I really like that these polishes are not thick and they apply really easily. So Eastcap also sent me a lamp to try out for you guys and I thought this video would be the perfect video to test it out. So this is a 86 watt UV LED lamp um, and it comes with four different timers. So it has 10 seconds, 30 seconds, 60 seconds, and 99 seconds. So the 99 second is the low heat mode. So it starts like with dimmed lights and then at the 50 second mark, it goes bright so like to the full potential so they also provided me with a discount code i had it on the screen and i will also have it in the description um if you don't want to have to enter the code you can just click the link in the description uh, for the lamp and that will apply the discount code already so you don't have to you know type it in or anything i actually really love this lamp it's really nice and it's actually really affordable too so yeah, I highly recommend you guys to go check it out and if you guys would like to, you guys can use my discount code. So now I'm applying a second coat of the gel polish and I will be curing that again in the lamp for about 60 seconds. After they come out of the lamp, I removed the sticky layer. I wiped them with alcohol. I'm gonna be using this white gel polish by Nell Addict, and it's called White Addict. And I'm gonna be using a liner brush. This brush came in a set um, that I bought from Amazon, and it didn't come like this. It came a little bit thicker, so I just trimmed it a little to make it thinner. So I'm basically just going to be outlining the tip of my nails um so pretty much like the free edge and the side walls yeah that's what i'm gonna be doing to all of my nails and then i'm gonna cure them in the lamp for 30 seconds
Alright, so after curing the white, I'm going to be using these pigments that I got off of AliExpress. And I'm going to be using this little brush. Um, the brush came in a, in a kiss kit. And so I'm going to be applying them in the same order that they're lined up. So I'm going to start off with the blue and then the purple. And then I'm going to use the purple on my index on the right side. And then the pink. The last color that I use on the nail will be used on the next nail as the first color. Um, so yeah, all I'm doing is just just like brushing it on and just blending it, blending the two colors in the middle, and these blend it out super easily. <laughs> I'm gonna clean up a little bit where I feel like I need to with some acetone and make brush. And then I'm gonna top coat my nails with the Madame Glam No Wipe Top Coat. Um, and then I'm gonna cure it in the lamp for 60 seconds. So yeah, this is the final result. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know a lot of you guys don't like voiceovers and stuff, and that's why you guys like my channel, but I feel like I needed to do a voiceover for this video. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in my next video.